Festival of Transport, I believe it's called. Classic car show, basically. So I've got Chris in Barney, the A35 in front. I've got Lyndon in the MG Midget behind. And we've got Andy in his Daimler, which is one of those Daimlers that looks like a Mark II Jag. But I don't know what the Daimler name is for, for that version. There they are, along with some other classics coming in. Apart from that golf, whatever it is in the background there. I don't know where to start here. There's, there's just cars everywhere. Oh, there's quite a bit of auto jumble here today. Lots to look through. There are five of them. There are five of them. They're car mats, yeah. And the two cuts are three quid. Wow, I'm very happy to find this stall. It's got a selection of rubber and piping and all sorts. And I managed to find the right piece for my micro sunroof. All these big handy bits of rubber as well. Rolls of stuff. Yeah. Rubber. Carpet. Mm. <laughs> No, no, it's called. It's fine. I like the British Leyland one. I couldn't believe it when you said that. Really nice on the left We had the uh, the rubber pipe stand. Now we've got the wire guy. <laughs> All sorts of stuff. Still can't control my gimbal, by the way. Might have some rubber things for Jesse here. There we go. Spare keys. I still can't get used to up and down on this camera. Very strange. Ooh. And they got a few stalls in the hall here as well. Oh my goodness. Uncontrollable gimbal action. Look, they're charging to get punched here. Do you want a punch? <laughs> <laughs> No bargain. <laughs> What's Bob selling? Hello Bob, how are you? Did you? Yeah, he said he saw you. Yeah. Oh. I need one of those, don't I? Lots of tools. <laughs> Handy picking tools. Ooh, washers and screws. You've still got all the cars to look at yet. Yeah? Hurry up before they go home. I got Lind and my chief funnel holder and everything else that I bought. <laughs> Let's see if anyone's nicked any bits off of Jesse. <laughs> My king lead, it's exceptionally erect. <laughs> yeah, got new wings on it. Well, there's a bit of commentary going on in the background, so I'll have to get close to the camera and shout at you. 
not that I've got a lot to say to be honest. I'm going to start looking around the 60s section, which is all of these. Beautiful Rolls Royce. Look at that interior. That is lush. Nineteen sixty nine. Now we've got a lot of black for that as well. Look at the Zephyr. Two point five litre. <laughs> 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 Looks like the Zephyr's escaping. <laughs> Here today, so I won't be looking around them all. An almost military looking triumph in this green. Mark one Cortina. I do like the red velour interior. Yes, really. Come on. Have you on the front row? Can you squeeze on the front row? Another roller. Thank you. And the we'll Joseph beige leather interior. And wood. <laughs> Lancia there from uh, the 1960s. That's looking good, isn't it? That is fabulous. So out there, any more cars? Zodiac. 1960 to 1969. 1960 to 1969. Let's have you in the arena for judging. And what a display of we've got. Absolutely fantastic. They're on about 60s cars going in for judging. I'll probably get like the duct tape and string award or something. Oh, 
This Royal Mail van is pretty cool, isn't it? <laughs> Well, here we are in the arena, and yeah, why not? <laughs> A few people have brought their 60s cars into the arena. Linda managed to come over in his MG. <laughs> <laughs> Very cool. Unique, innit? <laughs> That's the thing. You'd have to leave it like that. It's just unique, innit? You, you know, if you travel the world, you're never going to see that. Do you know where the wipers are? The wipers are in the roof. <laughs> There's Andy's Daimler. Oh, the Mini got going. That's good. I was worried about that. <laughs> Look at that. Like a Swiss watch. It's 1960 to 1969. I've said we've got some lovely vehicles here. A um, couple of minis now going back. We've got a Rover 100 coming as well. A couple of minis. Um, everyone that comes into the arena does get an exhibition flat. Um, now that looks like a lovely engine. Section, we will move on. She's almost bigger than the engine. Who's is that dodgy MG? Look, spot the difference. We have a Healy Sprite and an MG Midyear. <laughs> Basically the same car, isn't it? <laughs> Clearly, it's had a lot of TLC over the years. Um, and all your favorite the pictures there now. Um, it was in the United States of the state some time ago. What car is this? Oh, 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 no, no, it's all done. And he said we'll make a cup of tea with it. It's a Renault. It is now. It's a 1961. It is a little four-seater. And in many respects, it's like a mini, isn't it? It's a little bit like a state one. Very, very, very good. Only four apparently in there. Another Mustang. It's a thin red as well. Now, you say you haven't had it long, so do you know much about the history of it? Chris is in love with this. <laughs> and it may be the only pair of legs that we see today. <laughs> Just going to be going around looking at blokes' legs now. 
Lance, yeah. That's what Jeffy. I mean, a little car like this goes through the mold and wood around that. Wherever you go, it certainly turns heads, doesn't it? So, because it's so. I got a plan. What about those things that all the bobby were Let's have a quick scoot down here. Another Daimler. Zephyr. Zephyr and a Zodiac. See, I, I get, if you took the badges off of them, I'd get confused as to which one's the Zephyr and which is the Zodiac. So I'm guessing twin headlights is a difference. And I'm guessing the engine, I don't know. I'm not, not all up on these, I must say, but they are bloody lovely. Love the fins. Muffle, yeah. Muffle. See, that's got different these, trim lines under the back lights, isn't it? Reverse lights built into the bumper. Hmm. And the rear pillar. The pillar's different as well. Got a bigger quarter light. Hmm. I've not seen them two side by side before. Spitfire. Mark three. Didn't know there were so many marks. This is a lovely colour, isn't it? The metallic red. Singer, I think you call it a chamois. Yes, well, I, I, I did. I mean, I, I did. Well, that GT6 is nice. The girlfriend, oh, you can't, you can get less fun, doesn't it? The Wabasto roof. And that was it, and that was, you know, as I say, about that was 1988 sort of thing, you know. It's in nice used condition. Someone's enjoying this one. Spitfire. I think it will look a nice track. Lovely wheels, aren't they? Bugger to keep clean. Right, we're not going to judge this one's door gap here. It's obviously had a little bash. View of the TR7 interior there as well. And there's that Carmen gear that was in the uh, arena. Dolly, 1850. <laughs> oh dear, how did that get in here? Right then, I think that's all the 60s cars. 
Let's go and see what 70s are here. That's all for this video. Make sure you look out for part two. Thanks for watching. Bye.